Here are five tips to buying an off the plan apartment. Tip number one, get yourself into financial order. Go and speak to a broker. Get all your documentation together. Work out how much you can borrow. Work out what your borrowing capacity is. Work out what are the bank's lending policies for certain suburbs or locations or projects, which leads straight on to tip number two. Two, do your own research. This is the most vital tip of them all. Do not buy the first property you see. Make sure that you understand median property prices, research things like vacancy rate, rental yields, population growth, demographics of the area, walk the neighborhood, check out the transportation links, make sure you really understand what it is you're buying. Three, research the development team. This is the builder and the developer. Is this their first project? If not, go and check their previous projects and see what the buildings look like. Are they highly dilapidated or still look in great condition? Google both the developer and the builder and make sure they haven't had any bankruptcies or transgressions in their past. Do your own research on the property and the development team. Tip number four, get yourself a good conveyancer, a legal property specialist that has experience in off the plan apartments. Trust us, when that contract comes in, you will thank us. You're welcome. And number five, understand the timeframes. The first timeframe is when is the project meant to be completed or construction completes. The second timeframe is the sunset clause. This can be found in your contract and is a date you need to know about. And while I'm giving you five tips, here are also three things you do want to be concerned or alert to when buying an off-the-plan apartment. One, the project may not proceed, so do your own research on the developer and builder. Two, the finished product may look different to what you saw or anticipated. And three, you may even have had a little bit of capital depreciation because by the time the project is finished and construction has completed, property prices may have softened and the price you paid in the past may now not stack up to the price you have to pay when your mortgage arrives. Follow or like for more tips and videos.